So it was revealed yesterday by Holly's sister that DDG and Holly breakup was a prank. After DDG confessed, he also dropped a new single. Link to his new song is down below. But he also took to Twitter as well. He said, when you stop giving a f can't nothing hurt you. Nobody cheated on nobody, by the way. Don't take my tweets too serious. Someone tweet, DDG been a corny rich for a long time. Don't know why everybody's surprised. DDG retweet and responded, this is the proper way to call me corny. Don't forget that bag. Salute my brother. Let's take life too serious. We all gonna die at some point anyway. Let's try to have fun while we're here. Hallie is just not that girl you just wanna have fun with. Not in that type of way anyway. She's a different type of woman and you gotta move accordingly. She's signed underneath Beyonce. That speaks volumes right there. Sis don't need no clout. B was probably on the phone with Hallie like, yo, what's up? Sis, if you need to collab, I got you. This ain't it. Not with Beyonce and Jay-Z artists. They will remove you before you f*** up day money. Allegedly. Funny Mike threw Jalea a 25th birthday party. Happy birthday to Jalea. He also gifted her some diamond earrings and the birthday cake was nice and unique. And he spent over $12,000 for her birthday. Okay, that's how you turn up and go all out for your girl. Just got some precious shit from Janet Dang Lang. Janet Dang 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 Wang Wang Wang. Ooh, Lord. Turn up, Jalea. Happy birthday. Rudy and Sierra allegedly are back together. They were booed up at Julia's 25th birthday party. Ooh, look at them lovebirds. Ah, they in love. Oh, yeah, they in love. Uh. Now let's talk about Kamari because she did post a video of her and Nation with the caption that says, y'all not gonna lie, I miss my best friend Nation. It's sad, but I think it's gonna be a while before Kamari and Nation actually see each other again. Nike said this in her recent video. I ain't, I ain't talking about, I, I ain't saying she can, she can't fight and I ain't mentioning I no say, fight. And I ain't mentioning nothing about no fight. I was finna say, if they got tattoos right here, they can fight, but that's a lie. Chess boys. <laughs> that's a lot. From Roy Boy. That's where they get the tattoo from. They get from Roy Boy. So it's still a lot going on. It's shade being thrown from each party because I think Royalty said something in her video. I showed y'all what she said about the whole food stamp situation. And then now Nike said this. So it's still some bickering going on between the adults. Y'all leave y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all thinking when it comes to that. But let's talk about Kayla Nicole because recently she was at the Grammys over the weekend looking good on the red carpet. But of course people find something negative to say. Someone tweet a picture of her and they said need a boo job quick people did respond they said it's natural for that to happen she had a whole kid social media got y'all forgetting what natural real bodies look like now if she go get surgery people are gonna say she don't love herself and she should have stayed natural someone said you are beautiful please don't let these haters get to you kayla responded they're not i asked god to make me over as i took my spiritual journey last year i will not be broken and my calling won't stop calling me i'm here for my purpose and not to please people how they receive it it is personal i'm excited that kayla is dropping new music soon i suppose for her 100%. Y'all leave y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all thinking when it comes to that. Pop, your dad has uh, no I filter. I can't even do nothing because I'm like, throw. <laughs> Love me when you get in one in the moves. I'ma just wait till you finish. Cause you make it bright when it's dimmest. I see the light in your spirit. You my spiritual healer. I felt the evil of woman. And it made me indifferent. Should have been treating you different. 